Hey guys, it is officially all things fall. I know it is still August, but I am watching everybody on YouTube already share all of these fall decorate with me's new decor ideas, all of those things. So I figured it is time for me to go do some shopping. I have a house this year that I'm really excited to decorate. Last year, I was living in an apartment. You guys know I had moved into a two bedroom apartment with the boys. This was almost two years ago at this point, but last fall I did buy some items, but it was just for that apartment. I had a two bedroom apartment, not enough space to decorate. So I already knew that this year I was going to get some more things. So I went to Hobby Lobby, I went to Marshall's just to kind of so I went to Hobby Lobby, I went to Marshall's just to kind of see what they had. And there was a lot of repeats, like as far as Hobby Lobby goes, you guys know it's like hit or miss. Sometimes they get new things and then other times it's like they get the same things over and over. But I tried to switch it up and my heart was just leaning back to traditional fall. You guys know I love like buffalo check, kind of like the farmhouse rustic kind of look, hence those pillows that I've had for years. I pulled up a whole bunch of stuff from the basement from what I've already had and I had them up here. Figured it'd be a nice little background. But you guys know I love Buffalo Check, just traditional fall. So I tried to look at maybe more modern or more neutral because last year I kind of went with neutral. I did a little neutral last year, but something kept pulling me back to traditional colors. So this year I fell in love with burnt orange, blacks, and whites. I've been trying to incorporate more black into my home, just the pops of the black. It kind of gives it like that rustic modern touch. I'm kind of starting to slowly lean away from the farmhouse, but I really love like a modern rustic look. And there's just something about a solid black. I think it just, it really brings your home together. That's just my choice. I know everybody is different, but something about traditional fall you guys i just had to stick with the oranges and that so i'm gonna show you guys what i got from hobby lobby marshall's i only did get a couple things i just got some candles and some disposable cups for my coffee bar but other than that i'm really excited to decorate and i'm so glad that my favorite time of year is here it actually feels a little bit like fall today this weekend it's been in like the 70s i have my windows open the air is blowing in it is just beautiful <laughs> I also want to apologize in advance you guys if the video color is kind of off like I said it does kind of feel like fall it's really gloomy here today so I have like literally every light on in my house my above lights are those that yellow tone I have not switched them out to daylight like my kitchen and our bedroom so it's kind of giving it a yellow look but hopefully it's not too bad and you guys know I do film on my phone I broke my camera like before I moved so I have not invested in anything else yet so we're gonna dive right in I just wanted to kind of say that hopefully my video quality is not horrible so I'm gonna start off with Marshall's first since I literally only got like three things from there I got two candles and some disposable travel mugs so I got these cups I thought that these were really cute it's the cheetah you guys know I love cheetah print like crazy but it has the oranges and it says if you got it haunt it these are more i guess more so or more so towards halloween but i thought they were really cute i didn't really like the other ones that they had i'm probably not even going to display these these are just for on the go i just really love disposable mugs especially lake and too but i thought about that i'm like these are super girly but he'll still use them and then the two candles that I got, they're by that Sand and Fog brand. Really, really good brand of candles. They smell amazing. The first one I got was pumpkin and vanilla. The lid is really cute. Thankful, I thought that was cute. Oh, it just smells like fall in a candle. It smells so, so good. These were $7.99. These are solid heavy candles. And these are made with essential oils. Smelled really bomb. And then the other one I got was Autumn Harvest. I thought this cap on that one was really cute. Mm, this has like a good like cinnamon mix. Like it smells like kind of Christmas fall to me. It smells really, really good. But that was the Autumn Harvest. And I really thought that these were nice neutral colors too. So to display them throughout my home and they're gonna smell really good. I always like to get kind of two different scents of candles and burn them at the same time where they're like kind of similar but a little different. So the aroma is just amazing. 
but that was what I got from Marshalls. Like I said, they didn't really have too much in there that I really liked. And I felt like some of the things were overpriced and I knew I was going to Hobby Lobby and I can probably get something similar to what I was looking at at Marshalls for about half the price, which I did. So now I'm gonna share what I got from Hobby Lobby a lot of the same old things that they had but they did have some new colors like i said that burnt orange every time i saw it it was just like reeling me in my hobby lobby was actually insane too because they had some awesome clearance going on and then some other sales like that spring shop brand had 75 percent off and then they had clearance 90 percent off so i did check out some clearance and the first thing i saw was this cute little table decor this is this little cutting board and it was 79 cents you guys and it just has a little chip right there, but I found another piece that I'm gonna probably use with this and you're not even gonna see it, but I'm like, whatever, it was 99 cents. Look, this thing is like, it's a big size too. It was originally $8, but I saw that. I thought this could be used all year round. It'll fit in with my whole color, and my flow of my house. The other uh, clearance find that I got was this candle pillar for $3, you guys. It is pretty big too and it just takes one of those tall candles so I thought this would be really nice to kind of tie into and this is again something that I can use all year round not just for fall and then the last thing I got that was on clearance this was by the spring shop so this was 75% off it was originally 20 bucks so I think I only ended up paying like five something for it but this is a little wall what is it called let's see what it says just says metal jumble decor but I'm gonna put some floral in it and I already have the spot where I want it to go I'm gonna hang it up in my kitchen and this thing is really really cute I liked how it kind of had some of that farmhouse but then it has those blacks in there and this is gonna tie in really good with the floral that I picked up I'm so excited it looks so good together so with the floral I just got two bunches of these all the floral was 40% or 50% something like that but I got two bunches of these how pretty is that burnt orange so pretty I saw it and I was like oh yeah that's me so I'm gonna put it literally right in like this and it's gonna hang up on the wall I thought that that was really cute and then I also got these pumpkin picks these were $1.99 40% off I figured I can just stick these kind of poke them in I'm doing a horrible job displaying but you guys get my gist you get what I'm going for I thought that that would look really cute together something like that but these these this orange this burnt orange is so pretty it's like my favorite color this one I just grabbed this little it's a charcuterie board but I always think of these as like cutting boards you can never have too many of these cute little things you can display these and use these for so many different things all their fall decor was 40% off, so this is only like a dollar something I ended up paying for it. And again, my windows are opening, guys, so you're going to hear like cars driving by. Um, I got this cute little adorable pumpkin. I thought that this was so cute. It's a little fabric. I love the detail of this pumpkin. So cute. And again, it's that pretty orange. I just got this little, it says ornament, but these cute little signs. They had this one and one other one, but this is gonna either go on my little tear tray in my kitchen or on my coffee bar. I'm not decided yet. I will be sharing that decorate with me video. I'm gonna film it actually after I'm done filming this. And then I grabbed this fall sweet fall. I saw the buffalo check and I was like, the blacks, the whites, the burnt orange, it just all looks so good together. Like tell me that that color does not look good. I thought that this was really cute. My idea, my vision was I'm gonna set this up something like that and you see that little part that was next. Then I got this sign that says meals and memories are made here. I thought that this was really cute. They had another one I think it was in white and it had another saying on it but I thought this would be really cute for my kitchen and I, that burnt orange pulled me in. And I just got this little hello fall this little sign I can use this tier tray. You can use it so many different ways. And then for my tier tray, I also got this cute little espresso mug that says thankful for you. That They had another one that said like blessed or something like that. And then they also have these in like colors, but I didn't find them at my Hobby Lobby. Now my Hobby Lobby didn't have everything out. It's like they were still stocking a lot of stuff. So a lot of things that I saw like on other uh, 
shop with me videos I didn't see in my Hobby Lobby because they were still putting a lot of stuff out. So these are the only mugs I saw was the ones I had Saiyans on them. They had, from what I've seen that they're going to put out, they had them in different colors like some oranges, some blues, plain white, things like that. So I only was able to get this one. Then I got this mug for my coffee bar. It just says, hey there, pumpkin. Again, has the buffalo check. The blacks and the whites tied in with that orange. I got this cute little Burt's orange little logs they're just little bumped up little logs it looks like a little pumpkin i thought that this was super cute too then i am going to do a tablescape i went by the charger plates and i was like you know what i'm going to set my table up just really cute the kids we eat at it it's not that big of a deal i can easily move it when they're going to sit at it so it's not that big and i only bought two to set up but i got these little napkin pumpkin rings how cute are these they're leather they are so cute so cute i got these i need to get napkins i wanted all white from what hobby lobby had out they didn't have much out a lot of that aisle was still empty they didn't have the colors i want but i just want a plain white to go inside of these because of the duo that i did i got to these burnt orange leather charger plates adorable they literally match this but then i got the buffalo check to go inside like that. That mm, that looks so good together. I'm obsessed, I'm obsessed. It looks so good, so good. And like I said, I tried so hard you guys to stay away from like my traditional fall and like that whole farmhouse cozy feeling, but I don't know, something about that. It just looks so good and so cozy and so like inviting to me. And again, I know that our styles change things come in they go out but I feel like farmhouse is always going to be here to stay it like blew up and everybody still loves it but I didn't want to do too much of it but I saw this together and I knew that I had to get it I did also get two black pumpkins but I realized one of them I don't know what happened to it maybe it fell out um but I only have whoop, I only have one because I originally thought maybe to set it up like this that could be an alternative, really cute. But I really think I'm gonna get me some white napkins and just display that. I think that that's gonna look really good because that whole buffalo check and this burnt orange just looks amazing together. And then the last little pumpkin I got were just these two pumpkins. It's just a little galvanized pumpkin and then a little rustic kind of orange, burnt orange pumpkin. I thought that these were really cute. I like the style of them. They're different. I've never seen these last year, so I don't know if these are new. I noticed something. These say 2020, fall 2022. I'm trying to look to see if anything else says that. Because I wonder, like, how do you know? No, yep, because this says 2021. So this came out last year. These are new. That's exactly how you know. On the back of it, it actually says it. I never caught that. Because I was going to say, these... We're new these are new too this says fall 2022 as well that is so cool i never realized that these things said that these are new too you learn something new every day so the last things i got was more candles i love hobby lobby's candles my cousin got me into these candles about two months ago i went to a hobby lobby with her and she told me that they smell so good and they burn so good and they last and i've been hooked on them ever since they had candles 50% off, and then the fall candles were 40% off. So I got this black sand and cashmere. Oh, it smells so good. The jars are just so pretty. Like once they burn out, I don't wanna get rid of them because of how pretty they look. And then I did do the buttery pumpkin. That burnt orange again, and I love the gold cap. Oh, this smells so good. It smells like a fresh pumpkin pie coming out of the oven. You guys will have to let me know, are you a pumpkin pie eater or do you like sweet potato pie? I know a lot of people don't like pumpkins, some people like sweet potato, some don't like pie at all. You'll have to let me know what is your like go-to pie. But these are really, really pretty. And like I said, their candles are very good quality. They're originally 20 bucks. This was only 10 and I think the pumpkin fall one was 11.99 since it was only 40% off. I like to get these candles when they're half off 
because 10 bucks, these are very great quality candles and they smell so good when they burn and they burn for a long time, you guys. These will last you a good minute. They won't burn out fast. You know how some candles, you burn them and it feels like after the first use, they're like burnt down and there's nothing left. I can burn these for a good like two weeks, periods of time type thing. But that is going to sum up everything that I got in this Hobby Lobby haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it and you liked some of the new items. I think that's so cool that I just discovered that on the back of the tag you can find out if it is a new re release item or if it is an item that they've had from previous years. That is super cool. Never knew that. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you give this video a thumbs up, like it, and subscribe if you are new. And hopefully this gave you some inspiration. Like I said, the burnt orange, the blacks, the whites, they were just like calling my name. I spent like an hour and a half in Hobby Lobby looking at different themes. I had different things in my cart. I put so many things back, but every time I was coming across a black item, something with kind of farmhouse whites and that burnt orange, it was just like, okay, I'm a traditional fall girl for sure. Until the next video, you guys, stay beautiful, stay blessed, and don't forget how strong and powerful you are. Bye.